So today we're going to talk a little bit about maintaining focus. Focus is one of the hardest things I believe to maintain when you're working in an environment, especially on a computer where you have just a ton of options ahead of you or available to you to do whatever you need to do. So stay tuned. We're going to jump right to this and talk about how to stay focused, whether you're working, going to school or uh, what have you. Today we're going to talk about two different options really to do this and it doesn't have to be this specific software or approach but the concept should stay true for whatever you want to do so the first one really is um, <clears throat> find a device that isolates you within so that you can focus and I know this is a cost and so many of you especially students aren't going to have the funds to do this but this on this example, this is a Books, B-O-O-X device. It's a semi-colored um, type of environment where you just focus on specific things, reading and writing. So this is great if you're just wanting to read and write and do things. It You can keep it disconnected from the internet. It's just not as convenient as it is on a, on a machine to push on these things or on your phone. The second bit of device is really using Chrome to do that. We're going to spend a little bit of time talking about why and how we could set up those personal environments within Chrome. Chrome gives you a great way to separate out profiles. And as you can see, I have multiple profiles. And one of the benefits of this is that when you pull up your new Chrome profile, it's only going to have the things that you want. So in this case, this is my general one here, and it has a lot of stuff in it. So let's create a Chrome profile just for, let's just say school. So I'm gonna continue without a device there, and I'm gonna continue to use Google as my search engine. And here, I'm just gonna type in school. Now, this is pretty easy to do, um, and we're just gonna name, put that blue, and we're gonna say done. Now, that's it. Now you have a profile, so when you go into Chrome now, not that one, when you go into Chrome itself, you can see school has been added. Now what would I do with school? So the first thing I might do is put in drive.google, let's say you're using Google Drive, okay? What, whatever it is that you're using, it really doesn't matter. But here, let's say I'm using Google, dot, dot, Google Drive, and here I'm gonna just sign in and then I would take and, and tag that right here inside of my bookmark bar. So, and then I'm going to say done. Okay. Now, if you want to make sure that your bookmark bar appears, you're going to have to go in here as well. And it is bookmarks, bookmarks bar right there. Show bookmarks bar. So there's Google Drive. And I can rename this, by the way, if I just hit edit. And I can just say, let's just say Google Drive. Great. So when I come into my workspace and I want to begin working, I need to go to Google Drive. Let's say that maybe uh, Gmail is an option as well. So here I can just type in, I can just type in Gmail, right? And Gmail email. And I can just begin to set up this environment just for what I need to do, and then again, I just set here, I just type in Gmail, and hit done, and now I have Gmail. And if it's school or church or whatever it is that you're working on, now you have all those things. You can set up the environment, of course, to be um, anything that you want, right? You can set the screen, you can do all kinds of things, let's say, for example, you want the appearance to be dark so it's easier on your eyes. You can show the home button and create a custom area. Usually I like to put in google.com. You can um, you can do all, as you can see, you can do all kinds of things here. Um, it's somewhat endless, okay? So you can go ahead and turn all of that stuff on as well. So. 
this is really a great way to kind of isolate the way you're doing work. So when I come in in the morning or in the evening or whenever I got to do my schoolwork, I don't have to worry about where everything is. I just click on school and I go to wherever I need to go. And then um, I can find what I need easily and not get distracted by everything else that appears within my toolbar or within my environment. Just stay focused on this account and this browser window and you'll be good to go. Good luck.